The use of robots in healthcare is nothing new, but an Auckland University study has been trialling their benefits with dementia patients in a battle of beauty versus brains. Damien Christie explains. Humans have long dreamed of technology making their lives easier. Ah, <laughs> chilly dogs with the wakes. You're the best, Rosie. You betcha, Mr J. But when it comes to having robots in our everyday lives, it's not the homes of the hip, younger generation you'll see them in. In fact, quite the opposite. I believe it's time for you to take your lunchtime medication. For seven years, Auckland University has been studying the use of robots in healthcare. The latest research testing two robots in the dementia care home at Selwyn Village. Robot number one, Haro, a companion bot who's already shown great promise in its homeland, Japan. And robot number two, Guide, a health bot with a variety of functions. This robot can do things like remind people to take medication, it can show entertainment like videos, it can show photographs, it's got memory games. So which robot did the residents prefer? Take a guess. It definitely had the cuteness factor. So a lot of our residents had um, a very positive response to Paro, where they would um, feel a lot calmer by it, their mood would improve. But it's not a beauty contest and the findings will be used to help shape aged care in the future. We're looking at things like loneliness and depression. But with Guide Robot we can also look at things like adherence to medication and medication management. For the rest of us, at least for the foreseeable future, this is about as close to our own personal robot as we're likely to get. Damien Christie, One News, 